Good evening, the the Carrick fan here. Right, so back with another video. Some more Manchester United news for you. Right, so first of all, Mike Keegan from the Daily Mail has said that Manchester United's move for for Jude Bellingham is uncertain because of the ongoing take takeover uh, process. I mean, is I'm not surprised really because I'm not. Um, yeah, I'm I'm, I'm not surprised one bit. I don't, I, I still don't think we're, we're getting Jude Bellingham. No, I'm not jinxing it. I'm not playing mind games. It's, it's just my opinion, to be honest with you. Ho 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 hopefully, I'm wrong. Um, also, Rob Dawson has said that um, uh, Eric Eric Tenag want, what, wants uh, Frankie Diog if if he if the Dutch international becomes available at Barcelona. Although Eric Tenag, uh, excuse me, Eric Tenag's priority is to sign a. Um, an experienced striker, something tells me it's Harry Kane. Because we keep hearing about experienced striker, and for me, this leader to Harry Kane. Yes, he's almost 30, yeah, yeah, yeah. But he's a goal scorer. He, I would imagine, that, yeah, he was um, staying in the Premier League, obviously, and break Calagero's record, Premier League record, I should say. And the only club he could do it, do it at is my night, although saying, well, I was going to say Newcastle. Can't see that happening. Chelsea, no, obvious, for obvious reasons. Likewise with Arsenal, Man City, Liverpool, they've already got strikers, so the only viable option he's got in, in the Premier League is, is, is Manchester United, so we will just have to wait and see on that. Uh, wait, wait and see on that. Right, so you can tweet me at my new CD5 2022. Subscribe to our channel, the Cat Fan. Come over, like the video. Take care. Adios.